Good morning. This is not a personal fingerprints of God this morning, but rather fingerprints of God from Uganda. When coronavirus first became a real problem in the UK, just before lockdown, William and the team were praying for us and sending us Bible passages, including Psalm 91. Shortly afterwards, the first case was discovered in Uganda and we learned that they too had gone into lockdown. The impact on the communities we work in was huge. Living a hand-to-mouth existence and with all markets and small businesses closed, the people had no money to buy food from the shops and were quite literally starving. Amahawe Uganda immediately sent emergency relief to Williams Church in Customs to provide food packages for the most needy families. We also launched an appeal for donations. The response was quite overwhelming. However, just to complicate the situation in May, there followed devastating floods and landslides, which resulted in the loss of life, destruction of homes and the ch- and part of the hospital, and the washing away of the harvest. William was still responding by sending more Bible verses and telling us that God would pass them through. Despite the logistics of moving through and around flooding, with the money from the appeal, William brought food in bulk and distributed it to three churches, his church in Customs, the church in Buera and the church in Kasesi near the office. The laity from these churches then distributed food parcels to the most needy families in their area. To date, 1,059 families, the majority of who support six other people, have been fed with emergency food parcels. William also continues to work with the local council to try and feed the street children. At the moment, because public gatherings are banned, they are not able to collect up the street children like they usually do. Massica, who has eight children, says she thanks God who brought her food relief through the church. Ada, who is supporting six children and four grandchildren, said that through the COVID-19 lockdown, they were really starving, but now God has provided. We are truly seeing God work in Uganda through the church and because of your donations and prayers. Thank you.